So we're going to play the HWK30. Um, look, I'll level with you. This thing is really expensive. Um, I'm surprised it's a tier 8 light. It's the only tier 8 light I can find that's a premium though that has 10 degrees of gun depression. It has 10 degrees over the side. There's 9 degrees over the front. Which is an interesting thing a lot of people don't know about. Um, a lot of tanks have that better gun. I think the Panther was another one. Um, yeah, there's a lot of tanks that have better gun depression over the side than they do over the front. It's also very quick and it's actually got better armor than the RU-251. Now that is not to say that it has good armor. I'm not stretching it to that. But I think the front of this tank is about 60 odd millimeters. And the front of the RU-251 is like 30 millimeters. Both of them are horrific numbers, but the difference is that you won't always eat HE pens frontally in this, whereas the RU will eat HE pens everywhere. Like your ass is eight millimeters on the RU-251 and it's 23 millimeters on the HWK-30. Um, but the RU obviously has a lot better DPM. It's got another 15% or so damage per minute, which is a lot. About 2,750 DPM versus about 2,430. So those two numbers are, are different in and of themselves. And the problem I have is that I wish this were a cheaper tank because I know I looked at Reddit and a lot of people are like, oh, this is a terrible tank, kind of thing. And uh, for the price, not that it's a terrible tank. And what I find is that I actually really enjoy driving this thing. Uh, it's been really good for me. Why is it Type 62 there? Because you got this. Oh, dude, someone healing already. Um, they're not pushing here at all. We're just getting to shoot all over. Oh, here come the boys. They've decided that now is the time to do stuff. Trying to get low here. All right, let's see if we can't get some shots in the ass of this defender. Show you the... No, we can't. There's the Hesh. It gets 103 millimeters of HE pen, which is pretty freaking good, right? No joke, that's a lot of pen. And it's quick. Like, it's not... Are you quick? Are you? What the balls are these guys doing here? What the hell? Really? tough tank to pen with the and you can see it though it's still doable high rolling for 335 I mean that's what you can do with this hash the hash is really really good not a great game uh, but still this is what I'm finding with this tank I'll show you I've only played this is my press account so I don't really treat this very seriously but anyway, um, 10 games, 70%, 2,000 average damage. Okay, it's doing okay. I am I struggle with this. If I could get this tank cheaper, I would buy it in a heartbeat. Because for me, gun depression light tanks are probably my strongest tanks. Um, and there's not a lot of them. And you end up having to play a lot of LT432 if you want to play tier 8 premium lights or that kind of tank because there's just not a lot of other options. I'm going to try and do some stuff here. Don't love going this bridge because for all that it is still a pretty hefty tank. I mean, that, 
that's a pretty good thing to have. Like, the ability to hesh people is so cool in this tank. I mean, I'm not coming out there, Johnny. Gun's good, too. The DPM is good. The gun is good. It's got gun depression. Like, these are such cool things. Oh, my God. I've just given the gun a wrap. And then it goes and does that. Okay. And you can see, you can really accentuate that DPM by switching to that hash. It does such a nice job. She's pretty quick in reverse too, which is also a very important thing. Should have used hash in the GSOR, that's for damn sure. We're just dumping hash, and it's cheap to run hash too. That's the thing. Like you, every time you fire a hash round, it's costing you next to nothing, right? Oh, we're in trouble here, by the way. We can do this, though. Yeah, you're gonna eat damage. Like just because it's got a better um, armor profile than the RU251 <laughs> does not mean it's a good tank. We're all at gun depression we had over the back. That's handy. That's good. Oh, wow. That's, uh, that's not enough gun depression for that. Enough gun depression for you, though. 310 is a lot of damages. And it's just... This is the kind of tank I love running, hey? And that's... It's so freaking good to have 70 kilometers an hour as a top speed. Um, a gun that really works. And light tank camo. I mean, that's pretty freaking nice. It's just super crazy expensive. Now, if you've got some gold that you don't mind using. I've got 4,000 gold on my personal account. And even though it's incredibly unlikely that I get the tank, I'm so close to pulling the trigger on it because it's such a perfect tank for me. If you don't drive a lot of light tanks, if you don't drive a lot of super, super lightly armored light tanks at tier eight, it's not going to work. And it's very easy to tell. Like, if you can get the RU251 and drive that and you suck at it, then <laughs> don't go even thinking about the HWK30. Which of those two tanks is better? Well, I don't know. They're so similar. They really are. They they are such similar tanks. Obviously, this is a bigger version of the RU251, and it's not quite as quick. And I think the mobility and the DPM is what you're looking for. Your armor profile is terrible on either one. So you got to go with the RU as the better tank. But it doesn't earn the credits. And this this earns a lot of credits, you know? And I've been doing a fair bit of credit grinding uh, on my personal account. Can it move? Oh, yeah. She can move. Like, when she needs to, she can certainly move. I'm not abandoning them. I'm just not going to sit there because uh, that is not a place that I can be useful from. We can clear that like if he doesn't move. No, he's moved. Cool. trying to help out here and I mean this is a good play uh to make for our guys for god we're in trouble I should clear that Kayla if I get a chance without taking any more damage 
that didn't clear him. Look, I think it's fair. We did a fair approximation of a hold there on our boys. And we got to leave. This is not a play style that you're familiar with, and you're going to struggle. Gun's good. Like, there's no problems with the gun, hey. Yeah, they're getting nickeled and dived up now. Good hold by our IS-5 there. Very solid. Let's just clear some targets. One pussycat. Two pussycat. Three pussycat. <sighs> I mean, light tanks. What's there not to love about a light tank? It's just absolutely gorgeous to drive a light that makes money and that has ash high explosive plastic on the um on the he round i'll also explain why that's so important if you're running this tank i mean we've obviously got all our things boosted so we're earning a lot of cash with it but if you look at the rank on the tank i mean if you look at the um rounds right 102 base pen 270 average damage look at the cost on the rounds zero right so you're firing he um that can't be right what it costs next to nothing right no, it's only yeah of course the premium ammunition costs money what am i sick it was on the scent seven and one and i was firing promo hash so you're not, it's not costing you anything, those rounds. It's got good pen. The pen, the base pen on the gun is fine. 185 on a light tank is great because you saw how many of those shots were side shots when I wanted them. And 255 on your heat. And you're 2,429 DPM. That's pretty good, man. Like, I'd probably run engine accelerator. I need to be running that. I think that's a, a go. Um... Let's run another one. HWK30. Look, it's a good tank. Um, and I, I, I made, I'm making this video just because I was reading some of the comments on Reddit and everyone was very negative about it. Like it's just a bad RU kind of thing. And it's not. It's it's its own thing. It's, it's similar to the RU in every respect. It looks like the RU. It's got more armor though. It definitely has more armor. And although that might seem crazy, having more armor on this tank just means that when you're fighting good players who are in other light tanks if they won't be able to he you as often and you can actually use your dpm like you're playing with an armor profile that requires ap pen you're never gonna need apcr or heat like I'm not crazy i'm not talking wild foolishness uh, t54 mod ones moving oh, i mean the 54 mod ones are really tough to play against at this level Is an RU. I mean, it's a long way away. It's 450 meters, a lot of travel time. I want him. There's another light tank there somewhere. Hello. There's a. Same, same. can't be aggressive in these tanks that is wild to be doing that panthers over there Voll 
Team's not doing that great. A lot of stuff going on there. I'm just going to use AP because I can't be certain. Oh my god. Just going to try and keep that guy perma spotted so someone else can kill him. Guys. No? Oh, dude. Is he going to come around the corner? What about the 54 mod 1? Dude. Good, good. You say yes. I say no. You say hi. And I say, oh, whoops. I should have gone up and around. There's a KB3 here, right? There's an AT7 over there and there's a mod 1. I'm going back. Because these guys are going to push through. And there's plenty of chicken left on the bone. I don't want to be the point of attack. It's only been like three minutes. Not even that the game's been going. So there's plenty of time left. We're not even halfway through the game. People get way too worried about this. We're up on points in, a, in, in not long if we just sit and keep the cats. They're all sitting over there. Really? Okay. We're going to cap B too by the look of it. RU's got to be up there as well, surely. You say yes. I'm going to guess that they're going to push down towards that B cap. Sister damage. Damage. It's all good. I don't know where the light is, but he's not doing what he should be doing, which is uh, pushing out. Yeah, I couldn't really see through that. That was a dumb thing to do. Yeah, they're just gonna just gonna come second, apparently. I mean, good for you guys. I understand. What are they thinking? Righto. I mean, sit in the corner. That, that seems good. Sit in the corner. That seems a great idea. That's the HWK30. Such a simple drive. Such an easy tank to play. If you're a light tank gun depression player. And if you're not, possibly not as easy as you'd like it to be. Um, thank you so much for watching. Uh, thank you for liking the videos and, you know, doing the stuff on the channel. Um, it's nice. It's really nice to have everyone involved. 